Hi everybody, my name is uh, Mauro Scandiuzzo, I'm a field application engineer for ST Microelectronic and I'm covered the MEMS sensor. What I'm gonna present to you is an easy way to test our sensor. Let's talk about the 6-axis IMU, the latest 6-axis uh, IMU that is, is called LSM6DSO. How we can test that? First of all, we need an hardware, a motherboard. In particular, I choose the latest version of a motion board, then it's called a motion board V3, and this is the, the board. We need the adapter board with the 6-axis IMU, the LSM6DSO, and we need also the cable to connect the board, the motherboard, to our PC. In particular, we have a micro USB cable. In terms of uh, software, hardware, software and firmware, what do we need? So we need, first of all, uh, the possibility to communicate with computers, so we need to install the driver for the STM32 microcontroller. We need, uh, probably, update the firmware of the, on the Emotion board, and we need also the graphical user interface to communicate easily with the Emotion board. This is the three software part that we need to download from ST.com. So I connect my Emotion board to my PC. The first things that I need, and I can catch the driver from the ST.com. I need to type stlink. This is the link that I need. I scroll down, and the last part, I have the list. If I look carefully, what I need is the driver for Windows 7, 8, and 10. I'm downloading this get software, accept the license agreement. Once I have downloaded that, I will be able to see if uh, in reality my board is connected to a virtual com port. I can open my computer manager and I will see if there is an association with a common port. The other step will be to have an alignment respect the Unico version respect the firmware that installed. So I need to have a tool that uh, uh, allow me to update the firmware. In particular, I have uh, two different DFEU files. One is related to Emotion V2, and is in particular case that we are using the Emotion V3, I need this file, ProfiMems tool. So let's go in the st.com. So we need to download the, the software to be able to update the firmware on our Emotion board. The name of the software is called DFAUs. I press the link, I scroll down, and I just press Get Software. I need to accept the license agreement. Once you have uh, this, you need to unplug your board, press the button to enter in DFAUs mode, insert again the uh, USB cable and open the DFEUs. You will find that in ST Microelectronics, DFEUs, DFEUs demonstrator. And this time you see then the device is connected as DFEUs mode. I will, I will be sure then that happen because if I look here in my computer manager, I will see then the device is really connected in, in the FUSE mode. I need to choose the proper uh, the FUSE file, open it, and start to update the file. Once it is finished the update, I need to uh, remove uh, from my board from the DFUs mode. What I have to do, just press the leave DFUs mode and I will see then, basically I will go back in a COM port associated, so in a sort of user mode. At this point I can close the software that I use, the DFUs demonstration, go back to my PC and I can run the executable file. I have several um, devices on the left side of the graphical user interface, like accelerometer with a relative part number, gyroscope, uh, e-compass, then it means accelerometer plus magnetometer, magnetometer standalone, environmental sensor such as pressure sensor and humidity, and we have the last part from for the uh, enamel, so six-axis IMU. 
If I look the list here, I don't have my 6-axis uh, IMU LSM 6 DSO because it is a new device. I need to uh, create a shortcut. From the shortcut, I need to, let's say, just change the name to be sure then I will remember later Then this is uh, associated to LSM 6 DSO. Open the properties and at the end of the target line, add backslash lsm6 dso at this point i'm able to run this shortcut go in the section related to imu and i will see then there is an associated lsm6 dso when i select that will be the automatic uh, detection of the common port then is a common port 17 i will start the communication with my uh, motion board I need very easily to make sure that the device is working properly, press the easy configuration. There is a sort of pre-default configuration for the Excel and the gyroscope. Press the vertical tab with the plot, and I see that there is a three-axis Excel and three-axis gyroscope. If I move the board, I will be able to see then everything is working properly. Thanks everybody for watching the video and if you need more information please visit our website st.com. Thank you for your attention.